have and have got. Have and have got means possess, own, etc. We often use have got rather than have a loan. So you can say, we have got a new car, or we have a new car. Anne has got two sisters, or Anne has two sisters. We use have got or have for illnesses, pains, etc. I have got a headache, or I have a headache. In questions and negative sentences, there are three possible forms. Have you got any money? Do you have any money? Have you any money? Less usual. Has she got a car? Does she have a car? Has she a car? Less usual. I haven't got any money. I don't have any money. I haven't any money. Less usual. She hasn't got a car. She doesn't have a car. She hasn't a car. Less usual. When have means possess, etc., you cannot use continuous form is having, are having, etc. I have, I have got a headache, not I am having. For the past we use had, usually without got. Anne had long fair hair when she was a child, not Anne had got. In past questions and negative sentences, we normally use did, didn't. Did they have a car when they were living in London? I didn't have a watch, so I didn't know the time. Anne had long fair hair, didn't she? Have breakfast, have a bath, have a good time, etc. Have, but not have got is also used for many actions and experiences. For example, have breakfast, dinner, a cup of coffee, a cigarette, etc. A bath, a shower, a swim, a rest, a party, a holiday, a nice time, etc. An accident, an experience, a dream, etc. A look, at something, a chat with somebody. A baby means give birth to a baby. Difficulty, trouble, fun. Goodbye. I hope you have a nice time. Mary had a baby recently. Have got is not possible in these expressions. Compare. I usually have a sandwich for my lunch. Have means eat, not have got. But I have got some sandwiches. Would you like one? In American English, have is dropped in informal speech, like in the following example. We have got a problem. We got a problem. In these expressions, have is like other verbs. You can use continuous form is having, are having, etc. Where is suitable? I had a postcard from Fred this morning. He is on holiday. He says he is having a wonderful time. Not he has a wonderful time. The phone rang while we were having dinner. Not while we had. In questions and negative sentences, we normally use do, does, did. I don't usually have a big breakfast. Not I usually haven't. What time does Anne have lunch? Not has Anne lunch. Did you have any difficulty finding somewhere to live? Form and meaning. Have got and have are used to talk about position. I have got a new house. I have a new house. Has she got a car? Does she have a car? We have a house in Vancouver. 
We have got a house in Vancouver. She doesn't have any money. She hasn't got any money. He has a new car. He has got a new car. Do you have a minute? Have you got a minute? I don't have time right now. I haven't got time right now. I have an idea. I have got an idea. 2. Have got and have are used to talk about relationships. Have you got a girlfriend? Do you have a girlfriend? He has got three brothers. He has three brothers. I have a new boyfriend. I have got a new boyfriend. Mike doesn't have any brothers. Mike hasn't got any brothers. Do you have any children? Have you got any children? 3. Have got and have are used to talk about illnesses. I have got a bad cold. I have a bad cold. I have got a headache. I have a headache. She doesn't have a headache anymore. She hasn't got a headache anymore. Do you have the flu? Have you got the flu? 4. Have got and have are used to talk about characteristics. Her office has got a nice view. Her office has a nice view. Why has he got a tattoo? Why does he have a tattoo? Carol has brown eyes. Carol has got brown eyes. He doesn't have blonde hair. He hasn't got blonde hair. Does your sister have long hair? Has your sister got long hair? Additional points. Have got and have cannot be used in the progressive form to express the meanings above. I have got, I have a headache correct. I am having a headache incorrect. Have is more common than have got when talking in the past. She had a pink guitar when she was 13. More common. She had got a pink guitar when she was 13. Less common. Did you have a headache yesterday? More common. Had you got a headache yesterday? Less common. Notes Have got cannot be used for any other use of have. For example, talking about actions and experiences. I usually have dinner at 1800. Not I usually have got dinner at 1800. Have got is only used in present simple tense. It cannot be used in any other tense. I had a bad cold last week. Not, I had got a bad cold last week. Continuous form are not possible with these meanings of have and have got. Have got has nothing to do with get. It is not the present perfect form of get. In North American English, having gotten is the present perfect of get. Sometimes the have is left out of have got in spoken English. It is not acceptable to leave out have in written English. Here are some examples. Got milk. This is a popular advertising campaign for milk in North America. It should be. Have you got milk? Got a minute. In English, a minute is often used to mean a short amount of time. People often say, got a minute, which is short for do you have a minute or have you got a minute. I got a feeling. It should be actually be I have got a feeling. Got a is not a proper English word. It is what native speakers sometimes say instead of got a or got to. Now let's get down to practice. I have got a new computer. They haven't got any red chili peppers. She has got long brown hair. She hasn't got many friends. Daisy hasn't got her books yet. 
You haven't got fifty pence, have you? I have got swimming practice at seven. Fred has got a terrible cold. I have got an idea for the weekend. I have got all the inspiration I need. Have you got everything you need? Have you got any red chili peppers at home? Have you got a minute? I have two sisters. American English. Do you have change for ten dollars? American English. He doesn't have a clue about soccer. American English. Now let's have some trial test. You have to choose right answer. I can't make a phone call. I any change. A don't have. B haven't. C didn't have. D hasn't. E hadn't.